my mum doesn't use much makeup and I'm a makeup artist I want to do her makeup so first let's check her makeup collection oh no yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah cool cool I don't have much that's my makeup <laughs> is it is it all well yes hey, how, how many times do you do makeup Every three months. Every three months when you go out, you apply well, a mascara. <laughs> How old is the mascara? A year and a half. Oh, well, well, it should be okay still. Yeah, I hope it will be. Shall we try? Yeah. Okay. What else do you have? <laughs> well, do not do, anymore. What about nail varnish? No, I have nothing more. Yeah, that's it. One for many years. One lipstick. All right, that should be enough. Take the lipstick. Take the lipstick. I want to see what is it? Good, good. <laughs> Come, we go back to the studio. Oh my God! Twenty years ago, I used such colors, and now in my age, well, it's too much. So I use only this, and uh, I like it. I prefer only this. It's a lipstick that I gave you, is it? Yes, the little one. that was your present and it's wonderful, small and I like it. Sun damages the skin far more when you're older, so you really need to protect it. Therefore, I bought this lovely BB cream by La Roche-Posay, which has a factor 50 in it. But the main thing why I'm using a BB cream is because this will be moisturizing enough for the dry skin my mom has and also when I'll cover the pigmentation here it won't turn grey because it's sheer enough I can't cover all of it but I can even out a skin tone and that's far enough you don't need to cake up makeup on your face I recently bought an Urban Decay number no. 3 palette and this is the lightest color called Strange that I'm putting all over the eyelid and also under the brow bone because it's not shimmery this won't bounce light but it will just light the eyes that they come forward my MAC 217 brush that goes everywhere with me but I took only these brushes because uh, I couldn't put my makeup on a plane I don't have any makeup with me apart from what you see in the video I'm using Urban Decay's uh, Naked Free palette and this is color named Nuna which is a bit more burgundy like it's slightly purplish and open the eyes because my mom has brown eyes this will push the eyes forward I've made them light here they're darker here but still with this a bit of a pinky undertone my mom of course has hooded eyes this will happen to everyone so I tap a color here, it's not such a dark color. So even if you make a mistake, it, it, even, it doesn't show actually. But look, I'm patting it on the brow bone here. So I try to put color here and here I put it down in a C shape. And then I just extend it slightly outwards because this will lift her eyes. Easy, it's just like a C shape that has like a wink here. I'll use Full Slash Architect Mascara by L'Oreal, which I bought just for this video tutorial. Because as I said, we have a lovely surprise for you. And my mum's mascara is a bit too dry, so we're using something totally new. When you said do drugstore versus high-end makeup tutorials. This is actually a really bad mascara. I mean, look, if you're a teenager and you want to clump up your lashes, that's okay. This will do as well. All right. I just pull this out so there's no concentration on color on the start of the eye because then it makes this lovely transition. You see how I got it on my finger? I don't need a mirror. I can see myself here. Oh my god, you see yourself in that little mm -hmm. thing. Yes. That's beautiful. My husband 
just came back. You see his glasses? <laughs> he was running through the rain. <laughs> and now I will go there with my makeup. <laughs> this is wonderful river, Sava, and uh, rain stop. So this is my direction. Bye bye. Well, I'm here and you can decide. I told you my mom will be sweating. Look at this. BB cream stayed on because it was that greasy. It's an oil-based BB cream. Therefore, the sweat just drips off. It makes you a bit hotter, but if it would be water-based, nothing would stay on. I said a couple of bad things about it. I mean, you know, it's clumpy. It's a bit harder to use it, but look, mascara stayed on and it didn't run down. So this is actually a really cool mascara. This is it for today. I hope you enjoy my new makeup tutorials. I'm planning to do far more of these. I'm really trying to book mature women in my videos. Give me suggestions, whether you wanna see more different products or whatever, write down in comments. And we are having mum in my studio in London in a month because she's coming to visit me. And also, we prepare Halloween makeup on her. Stay tuned, don't be fools, don't follow makeup rules and I'll see you soon. Ciao, ciao.